monoblock and fasciotomy. Monoblock. For some patients, it's necessary to advance the midface as well as the forehead and upper part of the orbits. This combination is known as a monoblock procedure. This procedure is usually done with internal distractors to advance the bones. After removing the bone of the forehead, the orbits and upper jaw are cut. On each side, two distractors are placed, of which one is fixed behind the cheekbone and the other is fixed behind the upper orbital rim. Activation of the distractors pushes the facial skeleton forward. The advancement is one millimetre a day until the desired correction is achieved. The distractors are covered for the largest part by the skin. Only the end of the distractors protrudes through the skin and this part can be activated with a special screwdriver. The distraction takes about two to three weeks. After a period of three months, the distractors can be surgically removed. The monoblock procedure improves the facial profile, creates more volume for the brain, facilitates eyelid closure and improves occlusion and breathing. Fasciotomy or facial bipartition. To correct eyes that are positioned wide apart, a facial bipartition or fasciotomy can be executed. The excess of bone in between the orbits is removed in this procedure. This allows rotation of the orbits towards each other. An additional advantage is the widening of the upper jaw that occurs. It might be indicated to also advance the midface, comparable to the monoblock procedure. This generally requires the use of an external frame. If possible, internal distractors are also used to allow removal of the frame as soon as the distraction is finished. The time of distraction is usually two to three weeks. After three months, the bone is healed and the internal distractors can be surgically removed.